Hello YouTube, I'm Dr. Matt Hooper, and filming behind the camera today is Melody, the massage therapist. And one of the questions I get all the time from my patients is, what is the popping sound with your joints when you get adjusted or when you move and your back pops or your fingers pop? And does it bother your fingers or does it cause arthritis to pop your joints? To answer both of those questions, first of all, your joints are vacuum sealed uh, spaces. So your vacuum sealed space is filled with synovial fluid, which is a liquid inside of your joints which lubricates your joint. When you take a joint past end range and you open, you hear that pop? I don't know if you hear that pop on YouTube. Anyway, that space, you're making that space is vacuum sealed expand but it can't take on any properties from outside because it's in a vacuum so that liquid actually becomes a gas temporarily and that's called cavitation so it turns into a gas makes that pop and then instantly when that joint goes back to normal size it, it, it goes back to a liquid form from gas so the popping sound is not coming from your bones it's not coming from your ligaments, it's not coming from your muscles, it's not coming from anything that's, that's being damaged, it's coming from the liquid inside that is instantly becoming a gas and instantly going back into a liquid and makes a cavitation. So that's the answer to number one. Number two is does it cause arthritis to pop your knuckles? So that's, in my opinion, there's two ways to pop your knuckles. One can be very advantageous for your joints and another way can be damaging to your joints. Would you cause arthritis? Maybe not, but maybe ligament la laxity and you can cause uh, uh, loose joints if you did it wrong. But what I tell my patients is if their finger feels stuck, you always can take your finger and slightly pull it out and maybe give it a little bit of a twist. If it pops, then that's okay. What I don't suggest is when you crush your knuckles down like this or you're really expanding your, your joints past what they're supposed to do normally, you can cause it to be lax or loose. And that can potentially cause damage to mostly the joint capsule and the, the ligaments around uh, each joint. Not gonna cause arthritis because when you do cause a cavitation to your joints, when you cause that popping, it actually does help your joints loosen up and do better. In fact, I have patients that have very arthritic joints in their hands and when they pull and twist, their joints will become more lubricated and feel better. So anyway, those are the two questions I get a lot of, and I hope that helps you a little bit. Have a great day, YouTube, and I'll see you later.